This video clip is addressed to the Chief Executive of Colchester Borough Homes Limited and also the Chair of the Board of Colchester Borough Homes Limited. You will be aware that over months and, and years since March 2007, I have been bringing various issues to you uh, for mutually agreeable resolution. Unfortunately, those issues have not yet been addressed. I cite now um, an insurance claim that was presented to Zurich Municipal in January 2007. Unbeknown to me, um, two officers of Colchester Borough Homes Limited submitted for me um, and on my behalf a claim. They write, we felt it would be the best, best way to support your case with the insurers. The insurers informed me that Colchester Borough Homes had elected to deal with the claim in-house. The consequence of this is that any evidence that the claimant could supply to support the claim that she had been making since June 2005 was not passed to the insurers for them to consider. The outcropping of that is that the claim was declined. How this was dealt with by offices of Colchester Borough Homes appears to me to be most inappropriate. I did then actually ask for how this issue was dealt with to be investigated through the official complaints process. Um, I received a letter from one of the officers who handled this claim saying that he had approached the other officer um, of Colchester Borough Homes then being the finance director on how to address a request through the official complaints procedure. They had written to me stating that they um, were not prepared to start a complaint. So in effect, the, the people that I had asked or the people's actions whom I had asked to be investigated decided that they would not be investigated. The outcropping of this was that um, with myself in contact with Zurich, on January the 15th, 2008 Zurich met with officers of Colchester Borough Homes and Colchester Borough Council and it is believed that um, officers were instructed to reopen the claim but treat the claim as a new claim. Um, on, I, I continued to come back to Colchester Borough Homes through the board and on the 27th of March 2009 I received a communication um, I am writing in response to your request to sit down with Colchester Borough Homes' officers to review the history of your case since 2005 and agree what has taken place. Unfortunately, because you have an ongoing insurance claim with Colchester Borough Council that is directly linked to the history of your case, this is not something we can facilitate at this time. The um, claim was finally settled on the 19th of July 2011, so I returned to Colchester Borough Homes and to the Chief Executive and the Board of Colchester Borough Homes to enable these issues to be addressed. Unfortunately, I have now received a communication that the document which contains all of the evidence showing how officers have handled this issue, um, Colchester Borough Homes officers are declining to look into this document. Again, I'm being denied process and procedure. Um, we have a document here. There is the evidence. I can substantiate how the delays occurred and I would just like the opportunity to be able to come in and move towards mutually agreeable resolution because damages are still accruing at an exponential rate. Perhaps the chair of the board and um, the chief executive would get in contact with me at their earliest possible convenience so that we can discuss and resolve these issues and move towards closure. Thank you.